CNH Industrial India's Country Manager and Managing Director, Mr. Narendra Mittal, and its Corporate Communication and Employee Motivation, Ms. Madhu Kandhari, recently visited KJ Chopal at Krishi Jagran's head office in Delhi. Mr. Mittal joined the company in November 2016 as an Executive Director of India Manufacturing Operations. Currently, he is responsible to manage and oversee the company's operation in the market. With over two decades of experience, he brings relevant understanding and expertise in a number of areas including international sourcing, ISO, Kaizen, lean manufacturing, TQM and business growth. Mr. Dominic welcomed him at KJ Chopal. Mr. Mittal aims to view India as a huge opportunity for CNH to grow. Have a look. Two years ago, we started with the India Technology Center. In India Technology Center, we are close to 600 IT engineers. They are supporting the global companies because, you know, <laughs> currently we are doing iron. And then iron, when it gets embedded with technology, it becomes a different machine. So from iron, globally, we have our plan to move to precision technology, to have uh, technologically upgraded solutions for our products. Just to give you an example, like uh, uh, the auto guidance system for the sugarcane harvesters to improve the yield. This is what we have been doing worldwide. And the same thing we want to do in India also. So India Technology Center is supporting the global initiatives of upgrading the technology. We are supporting from India for all the companies in the CNS world worldwide. We also have CNH Capital here. CNH Capital is uh, the retail finance and the wholesale finance for our products and our dealers also. A good penetration, close to 30% penetration that we have with CNH Capital. So overall, I will say a very balanced portfolio. We have the entire product mix that we have here in India. So we have the tractors, we have the balers, we have uh, the entire crop solution equipment that is available here. And we have very good plans also. With the emission norms now, getting in place, especially for the construction equipment, we should be moving to uh, tier 5 in few months from now. So we are working on that. We will be bringing in technology in India. We will have an emissionized engine, electronic engine that will be produced uh, in our plant at Noida. And similarly, we are also planning to bring in big bailers in India. Currently, we are importing those bailers and we are selling those bailers, quite expensive but quite helpful also. With the crop residue management policy of the government supporting this initiative, I think this is going to be a big, big one for us and for the farmers in India. Because this has become a big business. Right now we are scratching the surface only in this case and we see it's going to improve further. And with the ethanol blending that we see, 20% ethanol blending, uh, I think with that will be compulsory by 2025 or 2026. We have already reached a level of 12%. We also see a good scope of sugarcane harvesting in India because sugarcane uh, is this is one area which will be really contributing towards higher level of ethanol blending. Uh, we are coming up with some advanced solutions, advanced technology to improve the yield. Just to inform you that even government of India, government of UP, it's in touch with us and requesting us to support the initiative to improve the mechanization in India. The state of UP, the mechanization level is as good as zero if I talk about sugar can harvesting. Karnataka is good, Maharashtra is good. So the yield difference, if you see, in Karnataka versus UP is huge. So same country, two different states, a different yield. And this is where we are trying to support the government initiative, of course supporting our own business also. And we feel that India has a long way to go and we can support this initiative in order to provide every possible help to the government to support the government to help India grow. 
from our side from cnh side i feel we have an excellent team at our, at uh, at cnh a good presence in india which is expected to grow we will bring in new products to india capping tractors high hp tractors 120 hp tractors round balers big balers so this is the plan for us and then main thing is bringing technology because globally we have been using technology quite extensively and we feel we have been pioneer in the past sugarcane we were the pioneer we were the one to bring in the sugarcane harvesters here now we are the ones who are who have brought the big balers and the round balers to india the tractors which we are selling here in india 150 hp and 60 hp tractors importing from baselda and this is where we feel once we localize those tractors here for bigger farms especially uh, for the crop residue management this is going to be a big big game changer because this is what is required and this will be produced in india as well this is our plan long term plan to do this in india so huge plan and with the support of this level of community i think everywhere we need to grow and we have a way forward and with your support with your support i think we can progress quite rapidly thank you very much The event concluded with a group photograph with the entire team of Trishi Chakrib.